Hi guys. Hey, a lot of you guys have been messaging me because page 233 in the workbook was kind of hard. And so you guys just wanted um, some help with it. So I had given a couple of you guys lessons. The rest of you, here's your help. Okay. So on that paper, you have four categories, right? You have adding ED, final E dropped. Adding ing, final e dropped. Adding ed, no spelling change. And adding ing, no spelling change. I'm gonna start with the ed words, okay? So I look at that list and I come up with borrowed and delivered and whispered, um, decided, things like that. So let's just start with borrowed, okay? So I'm gonna look at borrowed. And I'm going to, it's a little bit of a math problem. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take away that ed ending. And what do I get if I take that away? I get the word borrow. It's our nice root word, right? I'm going to borrow a pen from Mrs. Nugent, all right? I have to look at this word and I have to say, is that word spelled correctly? Yeah, it 100% is, right? That's how you spell borrow. And if you need to use Google to help you with that, please do. So I know that it's no spelling change. Nothing happened to it, right? Oh, wow, look. Adding ed, no spelling change. So borrowed is going to go in that column. Now let's move on to another word. Um, I'm just gonna choose a random one. Let's go with decided, okay? So, on decided, let me clear off my board. Oh my, somebody did not clean this. All right, now let me right, wipe it off on my pants. All right, next we have decided, right? Again, you're gonna take that ED off, okay? It's kind of like our math problem. Take the ED off, and you have D-E-C-I-D. -E Is that how you spell decide? It, you have to decide if that's how you spell decide. It's not, you're missing an E, right? That E has been dropped because you took the ED. Oh, wait a second. I have that other category, adding ED, final E dropped. Okay, see how easy that is? I just need to decide if I, when I take that ED ending off, is it still spelled correctly? If it's not and it's missing an E, it needs to go in the final E dropped. If it is spelled correctly, then it's no spelling change, okay? I'll do one more with you guys. Let's do delivered, like Mr. Nugent always wants to get pizza delivered, okay? So I've got delivered. First thing I need to do is take that ED ending off. Yep, is that spelled correctly, deliver? Yes it is, so it's a no spelling change. If it's spelled correctly, that means you don't need to change it, okay? So then deliver, we'll go there. I'll do one of the ING with you guys. It's the same thing though. You're just gonna take the ING off the end instead of ED, okay? So if I look at this, let's pick um, tiring. Okay, so I have tiring. I'm gonna take that ING off and what do I get? T-I-R. Is that spelled correctly? No, if you tire easily, that means that you need an E on the end, okay? Which means I know that it is, sorry, my stuff's falling now. I know that it's adding ing, final E dropped. Okay? If you guys need any more help with this, feel free to message me on Google Hangouts or email or whatever works for you. I miss you guys so much. If you need anything, let me know, okay? Bye guys, happy reading.